violation. Back away from the gate. Kitties, I got porn to watch. Spreading some good chaos today. Triple A chaos. Okay, but no screwing around. Well, okay then. Okay, now don't go screwing around. You're the new kid, right? Oh, great. Thanks for coming. Have a seat. Okay, this seat right over here, please. Okay. As your counselor, you can talk to me about anything, okay? Now, I understand you want to talk about sex. Okay, see, I'm highly trained in, um, uh, sex issues, okay, and you don't have to be afraid. Okay, new kid, it's, it's really simple. When, uh, when you want to talk about your sex, you simply, you can start by simply saying, you know, I'm, I'm a boy or a girl or other. Uh, you're a girl? Okay, we were all under the impression that, uh, can you just hang on a minute? I need you to call, call your parents, okay? Let's just take a second. Uh, hello, this is Mr. Mackey, the school counselor. Yes, hi. Um, uh, I have your child here in my office, and, well, uh, your child has just let me know that um, uh, she, she's actually a girl. Oh, you knew that? Okay. Well, no, no, of course, it's, it's fine. It's just uh, I, I believe everyone was under the impression that, um, that it was, he was a boy. I mean, she was a boy. Okay, so the whole king and stick of truth thing was actually was actually a girl the entire time. Okay. Yeah, no, that's that's great. That's great to know. Uh, I think I can really maybe be of help from here on out. Uh, thank you very much. Okay, bye bye now. Okay. Okay. Well, this is a shocker, new kid. Uh, perhaps we should clarify exactly what you mean by by a girl. Now, someone like your classmate, Bebe, well, she's what we would call a cisgendered girl, okay? Meaning she was born a girl. But there's also people in this world who identify as something different from what they were born with, okay? And, and, and we call those people transgendered. So, um, do you identify as being cisgendered or transgendered? Okay, well, great! 
I mean, I mean, it would also be great if you weren't, sis, but... Okay. Just be careful, okay? Because there's there's a lot of people out there who don't accept you for what you are, and then you're gonna have to deal with them, okay? So, uh, but come see me anytime. Welcome this thing to our town. I'm gonna punch you straight, just like I did Dale that one night in 94. If you actually read the Constitution, you'd understand it's my patriotic duty to fuck you up. That settles it. Beating you kids up was definitely the right decision. You are trying way too hard. Yeah, I saw that coming. America, love it or get your ass kicked, so please. Ah, ouch! Feel the wrath of human kite! <laughs> yeah, burning hair. I'm not bloodthirsty anymore. Oh, God damn. Oh, that was a blow to the ego. Yeah, I don't even want to bite these guys. What if I get contact on? Don't be scared, ball boy. It's just a little taste of your future. Check your watch, crime. It's kite time. <laughs> Excellent stare tactics, human kite. My turn. Not even a citronella candle will save you now. This is the part where the bad guys regret their life choices. Hey, butthole, you're doing great. Really quality character sheet stuff happening here. I've got a super secret mission for you. Head over to the new taco shop on Main Street and buy me a taco. Kim out. Well, hello, new child. I haven't seen you before, but you come at a crucial time. South Park is sliding into moral decline. Someone's stealing our cats. They're TPing houses. OK, 
Okay, maybe it's not full on Armageddon yet, but we do need a hero. Not to make the hard sell, but do you see yourself as a good person? Well, I can understand the confusion, but there comes a time when we need to choose our path. Will you find Jesus and take the righteous path? Or maybe you'll walk the middle way. Let's not talk about the third alternative. I'm hoping you're part of the solution, not the problem. Take the first step, my child, by entering this meditative chamber, which will allow you to confront your deepest fears. Face your fears, new child. Face your fears. Your dad fucked your mom. You afraid of the dark? Snakes? The color blue? Oh, hey, I'm in your imagination. Just a friendly Catholic priest who would like to get to know you a little better. Yeah. yeah, that's right. I'm totally in your imagination, too. About to give you a shoulder rub. Ever imagine you'd feel something like this? Let me adjust the lighting in here a bit so we can get some visuals with that. Oh, I guess this one likes it rough. No complaints here. God's love here. Who am I gonna give it to? Ha! Quit playing hard to get. Ruh. Open yourself to God's love. Almost ready to cover you in God's love. You bastard showing up. Well, you're definitely going to hell now. Get out of here! That's not what the Queen Spider says. I'll go say 10 Mel Harry's. Well, gosh, I feel just awful about all that. Tell you what, a rabbi friend gave me this macaroni picture. In times of trouble and tribulation, use it to call upon the prophet Moses. Good luck on your spiritual journey, my child. I would be proud to have a photo of us together, after all we've been through. <laughs> Bless you, new child. Kneel before Jesus. Remember when 
Morgan Freeman was God? Oh, yeah, I remember. Remember when Christians cared about the sick and the poor? Sure, I named it. Whenever you want to get somewhere, <laughs> call on me. Whenever you want to get somewhere, <laughs> call on me. Whenever you want to get somewhere. <laughs> Move along, we're creating chaos. Your precious global financial system is in flames. <laughs> Welcome to Freeman's Tacos. If there's anything I can interest you in, well, you just let me know. Freeman's Tacos is completely craft your own. You know what crafting is, don't you? Just open up that crafting menu and we can get started. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Let's start with a staple, the burrito. A warm tortilla wrapped around, well, any old something. Here, I'll give you what you need to get started. Now to just now that you've got your first taste of crafting, let's dig in. You can combine food items into whatever you like. Go ahead. See what happens if you combine a burrito and an enchilada. Congratulations, new kid. With an enchilada and a burrito, you've crafted an enchirito. That's the first time anyone's ever done that. And what the hell? Have a few more recipes. They might just save your stupid ass. Nothing left to do now but document this moment in human history with a selfie. Okay, let's never do that again. Welcome, and just one more thing. They say that some farts are so powerful they can actually bend the fabric of time. You be careful out there. New kid, you've done a decent job so far. Come back to the coon layer. I think we should advance your character. Coon out! New banking hours are never o'clock to never o'clock. Need to get somewhere fast, you kid? There you go. Fuck you, Mom. Ah, new kid, come, take a seat. All right, well, how's it going out there? Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm gonna upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. 
I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um, your character sucks, to be honest, and I think I'm gonna let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Ah, an elementalist like Storm and Captain Planet, I guess. Okay, I think those two will work nicely together. But now we're gonna need to change your backstory, too. So let's go back again to that fateful night. Back when you were little. You did lay awake that night, but the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power. You had to stop these thugs in their traps. You started by entrapping the biggest in an ice prison. Ooh. Ensnared by the cold, the intruder could only watch as it turned past him back. Hey, you can't just take a man's turn like that. Yeah, who do you think you are, kid? The intruders approached you, though little did they know they had set themselves up perfectly for a sand trap. I think this kid has some kind of power over ice and earth. Impossible. You took the opportunity to heal and focus your powers. I think I'll move over here. Oh man, I finally get a whack this damn kid. Feeling focused, you shrugged off the blow and readied your ultimate attack. Summoning the powers of ice, water, lightning, and earth, you unleashed into the intruders an elemental onslaught. You beat them. You swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe, and then that's when the unthinkable happened. You saw your dad. Fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you couldn't stop your mom from being fucked by your dad. That's heavy, man. I'm really sorry. I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Unifrance alert! Unifrance alert! Seriously, guys, alert! Alert! Unifrance alert! Mrs. Coon, what's happening? It's the Freedom Pal! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street! Hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! Supposed to be a duo, remember, Tweak? Yeah, I remember. So when I walked out on Coon and Friends, you should have walked out with me. I like Coon and Friends because you had your own movie. 
thank God you're here. They're really going at it. Super Craig had to have movies before Wonder Tweak was introduced. It made no sense otherwise. Your whole group makes no sense. Because you're a traitor, Tweak, and now you're with a group of super traitors. This was started by you. By people who thought there should be preferential treatment to certain heroes. We aren't the ones who walked out of the fucking franchise, Mysterion. Eric, you must listen to me. Right now, I'm speaking to you telepathically. Get out of my head, Timmy. Your franchise is going nowhere. Face the truth, Eric. You guys are kind of douchebags. He just called us douchebags in my mind. He did? All right, you son of a bitch. Ha! Good friends, deal with these assholes! Dinner is served. You guys are dinner. I'm gonna compromise somebody's immune system. Ever get the feeling life is punishing you for being a dick, Tweak? Don't! Bringing the thunder! Ow! Lame! I don't, you're lame! You're like the lamest lame of all time! That was lame, too. Weeks hurt? What a surprise. Time to shoot the lasers. Ow! Why does a kite have laser eyes anyway? Yeah. Dude, read my backstory. It's time. Don't just take that lying down, butt boy. Car! Car! Move! Fuck you, dude. It's Civil War, dick. Clear! Clear. Oh, am I up? Mega Pump Push! Oh! Target acquired. Upper tornado! Ow! Maybe that'll knock some sense into you. working for himself, new kid. Lasers online! Uh, Kite, you're fighting for the wrong side. This is my time. You won't see me coming. Today, you cross paths with the wrong immortal fourth grader. Did someone call for a fist in the face? for ya. Strike the innocent. I'll pull the law. Oh, you think you're still on the right side? Yes. Good to go, and so is my bug jar. my mind. You okay? No, seriously, you guys. He fucked the shit out of my brains. Uh, I grabbed him. We fought for a little bit, but his, his mental powers are too strong. So we did all that for nothing? Not quite. I got Timmy's cell phone. You did? There's sure to be a lead on that. Let's get this back to base. Super Craig can analyze it. Uh, hello. Is this the little superhero who is getting all the followers on Instagram? Your presence is requested. Then at City Hall, the mayor of South Park wishes to speak with you. Don't make her wait. I'm the fa fastest kid in town. You better run fast. 
There you go. Fuck you. Fuck you. Mom. Ah, there you are, butthole. What have you found, Super Craig? Timmy's phone has a bunch of notes in it. Something about a girl who has information about all the criminal activity in town. What girl? It just says, find the girl with the dick tattoo. What girl in town has a dick tattoo? I don't know, Mosquito. But the Freedom Pals must think she's the key to finding the missing cat. If the Freedom Pals find her before we do, they'll get the $100 reward. We cannot let that happen. We have to stop the Freedom Pals from having a sweet franchise. At all costs. Then we have to find the girl with that tattoo tonight. Fast Pass is right. We all have to sneak out of our houses tonight and search the entire town. What do you say, new kid? Are you up for it? Look, if you want to be a coon friend, you have to learn to communicate. Yeah, who let this guy join us anyway? Go easy on him, you guys. He's had a tough life. When he was six years old, his dad fucked his mom. What? I'm sorry, friend, but it's time they learned your tragic backstory. Butthole doesn't trust anyone because his dad fucked his mom and he couldn't do anything to stop it. That doesn't make any sense. I know. How could the person you trust do that to the only other person you love? Carbon, everyone's dad fucked everyone's mom. Huh? That's how it works, stupid. Our dads fucked our moms. Oh, right. So does that mean your dad fucked your mom, Cam? Huh? Yes! My dad fucked my mom. That's why I'm here. Don't steal his backstory, dude. That's not cool. You're so fucking stupid! Every human alive on Earth had a dad who fucked their mom and- Stop, stop. This is not what's important right now. We need to find the lady with the dick tattoo. Yeah, let's get home so we can prepare for evening missions. Let's go, coon friends. He's such a fucking idiot. It's okay. Calm down. I'm afraid you'll have to deal with that kind of bigotry your whole life, butto. When people don't understand, they lash out. I'm going to let you be a sidekick tonight to one of the coon friends. Go home and sneak out after your parents are asleep. I'll fill you in later. <laughs>